everyone, it's Blair here with Ocean View Home and Garden, and today we are going to talk about these weird little things here called tubers, which will actually grow up into beautiful flowers called dahlias. And don't be intimidated by these interesting looking little things. They're actually not as hard to grow as you think, and they're really satisfying to grow. Also, we have a beautiful selection of dahlias. We have dinner plate dahlias like Cafe Au Lait Royal. We have single petal dahlias. We also have decorative dahlias, fall dahlias, fringe dahlias, and these compact varieties, these little pon pon dahlias. But I would like to give you guys a bit of information before you start planting your dahlias, just to make sure you are planting them in the right location. First off, they are a full sun plant, so they need six hours or more of sunlight to grow. They also like a sandy, well-draining soil, although they can grow in heavy clay soils as well, but it is best to mix some sand in with that. And also, they are a zone eight, which means they're actually not hardy here in Nova Scotia. So when you plant them here in the spring, you will actually have to dig them back up in the fall, cut the tops off, and store them in a nice, dry, dark location. So you can actually start your dahlias inside if you like. You can start them in a grower's pot in a nice, light, well-draining soil, but you're gonna wanna do that mid to late April. So if you're planning to grow your dahlias starting outside, you're gonna have to wait just a little bit because it is a bit too early to plant your dahlias outside here in Nova Scotia. You're gonna wanna start those mid to late May once the danger of the last frost has passed. So when you are ready to plant your dahlias outside, you're gonna to wanna to plant them a foot to a foot and a half apart from each other and dig the hole about six inches deep. You're gonna to wanna to plant them on their side because they're actually gonna grow from the eyes of the dahlia, which is right here at the base, not actually from the top. So you're gonna cover them back over, give them a good soaking, and you are ready to enjoy watching your dahlias grow for the season. I actually have two more tips for you guys. The first one is if you get a compact variety dahlia like this pon pon here, you can actually grow them in a pot on your doorstep, which is a really nice spot if you don't have your own garden to plant in. Also, make sure if you're getting a large dahlia like Cafe Au Lait Royal, which is a dinner plate dahlia, so they're going to have huge blooms, it would be a good idea to add a peony ring around it or three stakes with some twine wrapped around just so when they start blooming, the plant's not going to fall over. And that is all for today. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to ask me in the comment section and also make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, find us on Instagram or Facebook at Ocean View Home and Garden. Thank you guys so much for watching.